What's up tech downloaders and welcome to another one of our videos. In today's video, we're going to be giving you some really quick tips on how to troubleshoot your iPhone not powering on. And these tips will work for any of the newer iPhones that are out. And it'll also work for any of the iPhones going back from the iPhone 6 and up. So if you enjoyed the video, guys, please, as normal, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below and also share your thoughts, comments and tips in the comment section below the video to help others out. Let's get started with the video. All right, so one of the first things you definitely want to do is you want to make sure your charging cable is working properly. One of the ways to do that is to first, you want to visually inspect the cable itself, inspect the head of the cable, inspect the USB portion of the cable, make sure everything is intact. There isn't any kind of loose wiring. There isn't any kind of bent marks. There isn't any kind of a wire, place where the wiring is coming loose. You also want to check your power outlet to make sure that there's power going into that particular outlet because you want to make sure that the iPhone is receiving charge the way it's supposed to. Sometimes uh, the simplest answer is that the phone just isn't getting a proper charge so it isn't charging properly so it's not turning on. So you always want to check the most I guess common reason that this problem happens and that's that the, the phone just isn't getting any power. You check that with your outlet you check that with the cable and then you plug in the actual cable itself into the iPhone and wait for it to give you a visual prompt on the screen that the cable is connected and the phone is charging. As long as you get that visual cue, you know your phone is charging, leave it to charge for a couple of minutes, uh, give it about maybe 10-15 minutes worth of a charge, try to power it on again and see if the iPhone starts up. If that is the case then you may want to look into getting a new charger or you may want to look into charging it in another area. The charger may be the issue. Now if the charger is not the issue, I'm going to show you how to do a hard reset on the phone and that can definitely help mitigate any kind of starting issues as well. Okay, so now if the charger is working fine, you're getting power the way it's supposed to, the next thing you want to do is do a hard reset and see if that fixes the issue. So the first thing you're going to need to do is quickly press the volume up button. Then you're going to quickly press the volume down button and then you're going to press and hold the side button in order to get it to fully do a hard reset. So again, it's press, press and press and hold and then you just keep holding and when you see the Apple logo appear then you can just release and let the phone do the reset. Now the phone itself is just going to reset the settings in the phone going to boot back up and once it boots back up hopefully that will fix or get you into the phone to where you're able to make your adjustments and kind of alleviate any problems with it not booting up in the first place. Now if all else fails the last resort would be to do a factory reset and that's putting the iPhone into a DFU mode. Now DFU stands for device firmware update mode and this mode is definitely your last resort. Okay so to put your phone into DFU mode uh, the first thing you're going to need to do is make sure the phone itself is connected to a PC that's running iTunes. Once you've established that and you make sure that the phone is completely turned off, you're going to press the on and off button on the side and you're going to hold it for about three seconds. Now after three seconds, while still pressing the on and off button, you're going to press the volume down button and then you're going to hold both buttons down for about 10 seconds. And then after 10 seconds, you're going to let go of the on and off button while keep holding down the volume down button for about another five seconds. Now on the iTunes screen you're going to see it say that it's detected the iPhone and you're going to see that the logo on the screen of the iPhone itself disappears. Now once your screen is blank and your iTunes has detected the phone you're now in DFU mode and from iTunes it'll start resetting the phone completely. Now again remember this is a complete wipe of the phone. All the information, all the data, pictures, music, everything is going to be completely gone but you can restore from one of your system backups all right guys so this has been a really quick tutorial on how to troubleshoot some of the issues that uh, may happen if your iphone isn't powering on at all if you enjoyed the video please go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below and also share your thoughts and comments down below on different how to's and walkthroughs you want to see on the channel and until next time guys peace out